It is Monday, March 11th. This is Grandman at McManus Meadows. Just uh, seeing what the cows are up to. Looks like they're all in the middle meadow. JB's enjoying some uh, some grass, but we're going to get uh, him a uh, smorgasbord here. Looks like they're all doing their thing. I'm going to just take this lane and nudge it to the right. And let's see. Sorry about that move. There's JB behind me. Yep. That'll be the first move today. And then before I leave, um, after I do a few more meetings, I will be uh, giving them more on our top meadow. I'm back and I'm hoping this uh, new mic that I have, probably need to go with the DJI mics at some point, but right now I've bought an inexpensive one. Hopefully it'll reduce the wind noise. But I've just moved this line over, so it's quite a bit of green grass. And the last rotation around this uh, middle meadow, we're going to give them the edge like we're doing up on the top. But uh, let's just see what JB's up to. Yeah, forgot to check uh, goggles as I walked by, but uh, we'll check her out in a little bit. Getting closer. I wonder if I'm going to be saying this in a couple months, but trying to figure out um, how close we are to the, uh, the calves coming with... Um, both uh, goggles and with uh, Millie. More to come in a little bit. The uh, cows are in the middle feed, in the middle meadow, and we're up here in the top. This is the the broom sedge area where we uh, we unrolled a bunch of uh, hay and then spread it out with pitchforks and whatnot. Um, probably going to use this as the uh, the title for this for this video. But let's see. Let's see over the course of the next month or two what happens with this area that's got the most uh, most hay spread out on top of what was a lot of broom's edge. So we're kind of sit between, but we're just off the top of the ridge and a little bit south. So, and then you can see that we didn't get as much hay down um, in this section here, but you can also see that the cows were, uh, were reasonably active as well. More to come later. All right, this is going to be it for today. This is uh, sort of at the end of the day. They've had the uh, middle field, quite a bit extra on the middle field, and we're back up on the uh, on the top meadow, <clears throat> and they, uh, they were all down at the water. One of these days when I uh, get a um, tripod or a, a selfie stick, I'll, uh, I'll do a video of the, the herd walking all the way up to wherever I'm going and about to give them some, some new grass. But right now, um, we're going to take this uh, poly wire out.
and they're going to have this little section here. There's actually quite a bit here, and this plus the uh, the lane and the stuff they have in the middle will give them a lot overnight. So let's see. Today's video that we published was the one where I got shocked and I'm not doing a repeat performance of that but uh, yep here they go <clears throat> let's go ginger let's go JB here comes the moms immediately heads down That's going to be it for today. Uh, we'll publish this one tomorrow. Thanks for those that are watching, and hopefully it's helpful to anyone trying to learn how to start small on the regenerative uh, farming journey. Thanks.